Hey guys, Shock here from Shock e Tech, and in today's video, we have a powerful new update for Samsung Galaxy smartphones that activates a stunning feature. So let's dive in and get started right away. This is going to apply to One UI 6.1, 6.0, or older. So first, let me show you what I'm talking about, and then I'm going to show you guys how to set it up. So look at this. I'm going to double tap on the home screen to go to the lock screen. I want you guys to see what happens. Double tap. Look at that beautiful fluid effect. Now again, if I double tap to wake it up, this is the always on display. Now this is the S24 Ultra, so we have the full screen always on display, but the actual feature I'm talking about applies to any other Samsung phone. So let me double tap, I'm gonna show you guys. Look at that beautiful fluid animation. Okay, if I double tap it to make it to go sleep, to the always on display, we get the same thing. Double tap to wake it up, we get the same thing, and then I can log right in. Now one more thing I'm gonna show you guys is, when I do lock the screen, if I unlock the phone straight from the always on display by tapping the fingerprint sensor, we also get the transition effect going from the lock screen to the home screen, which is beautiful. Absolutely stunning. Let's look at the update and let's see how to get it done. All right, so basically this update comes via good luck for the Wonderland module. So the good luck application is this one right here. Okay, that's a Samsung application. And then Wonderland module is right here. So to get the latest update, what you wanna do is you wanna click the link down below. Once you click the link, you are gonna be at this website. Then what you wanna do is you wanna scroll down a little bit, okay? And for the Wonderland link, you want to click this and you want to get the latest update. Now in my case, it's already updated and that is gonna be the version 1.5.09. And you can see it says support new lock screen effect, the fluid effect, which we just showed you guys. And if I scroll down here, you can see the size is 85 megabytes. Now the update date is a little funny. It says March 12th, but I haven't gotten this update till today actually, but you should have it now. So now let me go out. Okay, by the way, if you don't have good luck, you can go to the website and you can click this link to get the good luck. So once you have all that stuff, tap on open, all right? And then you want to go into the Wonderland module. And then when you're in the Wonderland module, you are gonna see this welcome screen and you wanna click the one at the bottom, this one right here. From here, you tap on new, okay? So the first step is to tap this button and pick a lock screen wallpaper over here and an always on display wallpaper over here. So first I'm gonna tap on the gallery icon. I'm gonna scroll down. I'm gonna pick the lock screen wallpaper. As an example, I'm gonna use this one. And then I'm gonna choose the AOD wallpaper, again from the gallery, whatever you want. And in this case, I'm gonna pick this one right here, okay? Once you have picked them both, you tap on close and you tap on the effect. And then the brand new effect with the latest update is gonna be all the way on the side, known as the fluid effect as you can see, okay? You also have these other effects, but these are existing effects that you already had before, okay? So let's look at this one. That's the fluid effect. It is absolutely beautiful. So first and foremost, you can look at what it looks like when the screen is off and on. So you can preview it right here. Then you can tap this button and you can change the effect speed, okay? Effect speed. Uh, the movement, the cohesion, the masking, and all that good stuff. You can try all those if you want. And then finally, after all the parameters are set, you tap on save, okay? Tap on save or overwrite if you're editing existing wallpaper, and then make sure tap on set as wallpaper, and now it is all set, okay? I'm gonna show you one more thing, by the way. Look at this, beautiful. Now, one more thing, after you set it up, you can, you can go back, and go into the existing stuff and look at what I can do. If I tap on edit, I can also come right here and adjust the size of the images, okay? That's the screen off, the lock screen, that's the always on display. So if I tap on this one right here, I can change the size of that too. So let me see if they are pretty close, a little bit more, let's move it here, okay? So you can fine tune it to perfection based on your needs. Let me just, a little bit more. I think that looks much better. Then I can tap and overwrite. And after you overwrite, you can do a set as wallpaper again. And now we have that new style. Beautiful guys. Any questions, comments, concerns, drop them down below. Let me know for now. 
Have a fantastic day.